Happy holidays, everyone. I hope you're having a great year so far. 2020 has been a little rough on all of us, but hopefully going into the new year, things get a little bit better. On that note, I wanted to let everyone know that I am doing CMAs, Comparable Market Analysis, for past clients, current clients, friends, family, and just anyone in general who is looking to know the value of your home. It's important to know the value of your home, not only in, in case you're thinking of selling, but also to just take to your insurance agent or also your financial planner, make sure that if you do take it to your insurance agent, that your coverage on your home is adequate and up to date for what your home is currently worth. And also just your home value and the equity that you get in your home definitely plays a big role uh, down the road during those retirement years. So just to let you guys know, you can look on Zillow. I don't recommend it. You can reach out to any agent. You can reach out to myself. I'm going to let you know what all is included in my CMA. And it's pretty short. If you want to just shoot me a text, a call, an email, a DM on social media, um, I just need bare minimal information from you. And I can probably get you a pretty good estimate of what your home is worth. Or if you want the full in-depth folder information, uh, same thing. It won't take me very long, 10 to 30 minutes, however long it takes me to actually pull it out, print it out and get it to you. So what consists in my folder, you will find there is a copy from my uh, Berkshire Hathaway company. And this pretty much just is kind of a generic of what you would find if you went on Zillow. This is going to pull comparable homes to yours in a you know quarter mile radius, uh, half mile radius. And the reason that I don't really like Zillow and a lot of agents don't like Zillow or trust Zillow is because it pulls comps based on purely square footage of your home, number of beds and baths, and in that radius. And a lot of you know that even within that small radius, not homes, all homes are not the same. There are many neighborhoods that you know, maybe are within the same half mile, quarter mile radius, but there's that one main drag that separates the estates from, you know, these townhomes. And if you live in a single family home and across the street is a community of townhomes or condos, that's not gonna really represent well the true value of what your home is worth. So uh, in my little folder, like I said, this is kind of the generic one that Brookshire Hathaway puts out for us. It's really informative. It is more of an estimate, computerized, what you would get from Zillow, but it does have some really cool features that I can explain and get into more. But what you're gonna get from me, which I feel is more beneficial, is myself diving into the MLS and pulling up comps of homes that are similar to yours in number of size of beds, baths, square footage, um, actual sub like subdivisions, suburbs, um, and more so just any updated remodels. I can go in, I can look at the pictures, I can see the agent remarks, I can see what people have done to their home to upgrade it, uh, remodel, not do anything to it, let it go to crap. So with this, this will give you an estimate of the homes in your area that are similar to your home itself and what they sold for. And this way with pictures and descriptions, you can actually kind of gauge where your home fits in with those price points. So this home in particular, I picked a Castle Rock home right between my Denver and my Colorado Springs. I'm all up and down the front range. And this home itself kind of fell right in the middle. This had minimal upgrades, upgrades to the kitchen, but maybe not baths. So on and so on. I could go on and explain it in depth. But just to let you guys know, I am doing this time of year free, no obligation, CMA to those who are curious about their home worth. So if you do have any questions and you want to know what your home is worth right now, whether you're considering selling now in the future or just want to, like I said, take that information to your insurance agent or estate planner. Uh, yeah, that would be a good idea. I definitely recommend it. So reach out with any questions. Like I said, call, text, email. I'm always available. And I hope you guys have a safe and wonderful new year. We'll see you soon.